I wish he asked him for ecstasy. <laughs> These are all great ideas, but he got he got any ecstasy. When we made it to the bar, there's a group outside who recognized some of the players we were with and told us they were just waiting for the bar to finish clearing the area for us. I had no idea who they were, so I introduced myself with all the confidence I could muster and acted like we were part of the crew the whole time. Unbeknownst to me at the time, the guys waiting for us outside of the bar were executives from Justin TV. Holy shit! The booming streaming live streaming platform that was rapidly gaining momentum in esports. Really? Among the group was the CEO of Emilet Shear and COO Kevin Lin, who were both heavily involved with founding the platform? That's crazy. We were worried about intruding on their private party. However, once we told them that we were using their platform to broadcast our events, oh, they opened us with open arms. When we sat down to eat, I was lucky enough to get a seat next to Emmett. It was incredible to think that less than an hour ago, I was worried I wouldn't even get to the after party after all. And now here I was, not only at the party, but sitting next to the biggest decision maker in the space. It was a surreal moment. I think Emmett could tell I was a little bit shy. He was very courteous about working me into the conversation. Ooh, without that sentence was going to go somewhere else. Woohoo! Close call. Emmett asked me all sorts of questions about being a content creator and running online tournaments. He was very curious to hear what I looked for in a good broadcasting platform and what features were lacking on Justin TV. I suggested things like the detailed statistics about the audience beyond the number of live viewers, such as demographics, time watched, and age. He was quick to agree that a lot of my suggestions, and though he didn't reveal too much about what was in their plans, it was obvious that he had rapid expansions on the horizon. Once we finish... <laughs> I wish he asked him for ecstasy. Now, <laughs> these are all great ideas, but he got, he got any ecstasy? Once we finished eating, I didn't know what else to think about him. Looking back, it was an incredible opportunity to project confidence and impress someone with a lot of influence. But I was too afraid to say the wrong thing. I got stuck in my own head, dwelling on trying to find the perfect question instead of engaging with him like anyone else at the party. He was probably the nicest and most approachable CEO I ever met, and I still couldn't get out of my head enough to form a real connection. It was yet another powerful learning experience, perhaps even an opportunity that presented itself before I was ready. Don't be too hard on yourself, Zayori. Okay? You'll make it, little guy. Keep on trucking. It didn't matter, though. The place started erupting around the same time that we finished eating. Gamers were coming in droves as word spread that Justin TV guys were throwing a party and picking up most of the tab. We outgrew the private room in the back, and as our loud, rambunctious group spilled onto the main floor, more of the regulars cleared out. <laughs> Who the hell are these nerds? Let's get the hell out of here. This uh, TGI Fridays is getting crazy. We gotta go. Soon after, the guy who hosted the hotel party the night before showed up, and that's when things really started popping off. His first course of action was to buy a beer tower for each table, along with a round of shots. He topped it off by plopping down a credit card to keep the tab open, and he continued to order rounds for anybody that came his way. You don't even remember that guy's name. You remember Matt, but you don't remember this dude? This dude sounds like a goddamn alpha, Zayori. Screw Justin TV. Talk to this guy. Going around with beer, beer towers and shots. This guy's a goddamn animal. Screw Justin TV. To hear the rest of the story, pick up a copy of Surviving Esports, The Zayori Story, in paperback, ebook, and audiobook, available on Amazon.com.